Galatians 1, verse 15 to 16. But when God, who set me apart from my mother's womb and called me by his grace, was pleased to reveal his son in me, so that I might preach him among the Gentiles. My immediate response was not to consult any human being. Now, this is an example of a prevenient grace. It is the grace of God in a person's life that comes and prepares him or her to a conversion and for a greater good, right? So, a person may be on his last dying breath and yet he is kept away from dying and he's not going to be allowed to miss his appointed day. And that's prevenient grace. You can see the markers in many cases of how God was moving them from the right uh, to the right places to meet the right people, to be in the right places at the right time, to have those experiences that is needed to line up so that when the gospel did show up, they were ready for it. All those things are evidence of God that God has marked us out, you and me. So it is not by chance, neither it is a coincidence, it's not a random thing, it's not by our will, but his own will. So Paul here was set apart and then appointed. And that call went deeper than, a, than simply a call to believe. His call was to, uh, to go out further and serve God as an apostle. Paul say that call was from none other than Jesus Christ himself.